Delaware Valley's leading news program. The Action News team out working on news stories for tonight, beginning at 4. Alicia Federelli live in the newsroom with a preview. Hi, Alicia. Hey, guys. How you doing? You know, it is Thursday, and that means that it's time for another one of meteorologist Adam Joseph's outdoor adventures. Lucky him. What a gorgeous week to be outdoors. Today, he is heading to Lynn Villa Orchards in Middletown Township, a great, fun festive place to be this fall. So we'll take you there today coming up at four and time for another one of Adam's outdoor adventures today. He is live at Lynn Villa Orchards. Go Adam. <laughs> you know, I found out what they do with the bruised apples that fall from the tree on the ground. They have apple slingshots here at Lynn Villa Orchards. I got Emily and Anna Marie. They're helping me here. You guys having a good time? Yeah. All right, we're trying to hit the targets there in the field. You can see pumpkin targets, regular targets. You know what? This is actually a lot of fun, and we're using apples that would go to waste anyway. I'll have much more coming up in that AccuWeather forecast and let you know if this cloudy weather will turn bright. We've got some record warmth heading our way, and we'll have that seven-day forecast. Yeah, take your glasses off. It'll be easier to pull it across coming up when Action News returns right after this break. Ready? All right, time now for AccuWeather and another one of Adam's outdoor adventures. Okay, today he's live at Lynn Villa Orchards in Middletown Township. Hi, Adam. Hey guys, you know, it's a little cloudy today, a little on the damp side, but still very warm when you take a look at November standards and Lynn Villa Orchards, there's so much to do here. You think about fall, you think about winter, you think of cutting your tree down, they have their own tree farm. You can still pick your apples right through the beginning of December. It was a bumper apple crop this year. Also behind me, you do have a playground here. Again, on a day when the sun would be shining, it would be packed. So again, there's a lot more to do here than just to come and pick up that pie for the holiday season. Another thing you can do here at Lynn Villa is get your face painted. Really a, let's just say, awesome time for the kids. And you can see, Julia, what are you becoming here, young lady? A butterfly. A butterfly. Can you turn to the camera so you can show everybody how great she looks here? And you're here pretty much every day during the week, Lynn Villa? Actually, we'll be here every weekend in November. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. $8 a face. Come get your face painted. Yeah, and you can look <laughs> like her. And what other kind of characters do you do? We have tigers. We have skulls. We have bunnies, pirates, pretty much anything. Anything you from of. the scary to the fluffy yeah. on that level. All right, you continue to make her face look great. It looks great even without the makeup on there. But guys, coming up in the next half hour, uh, we'll check out some of the other sites that you can do here this upcoming weekend at Lynn Villa. But in the meantime, I'm going to see how she does this. You should get your face painted. I know. I thought that would be a part of this, Adam. What do you say? Uh, my son's coming here. I'll, I'll let him do okay, it. the honors of that. Sure. <laughs> Passing the buck to the child. Always does. Mm -hmm. okay, All right, Adam, Adam. Thanks. As we head back outside now to Middletown Township and meteorologist Adam Joseph. Yeah, he's live at Lynn Villa Orchards with more on some of those activities you can find this fall season. Hi, Adam. Yeah, you know, it's been a fantastic fall season weather wise, and it continues into this weekend at Lynn Villa Orchards as well. And you know what? I've got to show you the cutest little pumpkins ever. Take a look at these eight month old twins, Haley and Abby. These girls have been doing so good. They've been sitting here for four minutes, right? <laughs> yes. Before we've been going on live. And it's not late enough to get that perfect picture with them on the pumpkin, is nope, it? Nope, never. How is it, little? How are you? Can you wait to. Look at, there's a smile. I got a smile. She's smiling at mom, not at me, not at the camera, but I will take that. And again, Lynn Villa is still the place to be. They still have a big weekend ahead for those fall activities. We'll let you know what's going on here this upcoming weekend. And guys will also give you that seven day forecast coming up in just a little bit. Brian, you've got twins. I yeah. mean, how adorable were they? Very, yeah. I got a soft spot in my heart for twins, but they <laughs> are so cute. Adam, thank you so much. Yeah. Not the most beautiful day out there, but always a good day to be outside at Lynn Villa Orchards. Yeah, it's uh, maybe a little gloomy today compared yeah. to the rest of the week, but we know who can find the bright spots. Meteorologist Adam Joseph, he's out there at Lynn Villa Orchards with <laughs> oh, a look at the forecast. You guys are sweet. Hey, Adam. I like you, so Very of course sweet I'm sweet. Very sweet of you guys to she say. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's still a lot to do, despite that, you know, it doesn't feel like fall. Fall continues here at Lynn Villa Orchard. I mean, you can get your apples. The apples right now on sale for the next week or so, 99 cents a pound, no matter what apple that you find. And also, there's still a lot of pumpkins you can choose from. And here's the question, which pumpkins are decorating pumpkins and which ones are edible pumpkins? I'll let you know, and the hint is, do not judge a book 
by its cover. We've got Farmer Norm here, and I tell you, Welcome. you were telling me that we, you can actually still pick apples through the beginning or maybe middle of December? Yeah, this year we have a bumper crop. We have a lot of new varieties, Pink Lady, Granny Smith, and uh, Gold Rush. Mm -hmm. That'll pick well into December as long as we don't have a hard freeze. And this weekend, it's going to be a great w weekend weather-wise. There's still a lot to do in this area, right? Oh, Pumpkin Land is open this weekend. We have the hay rides, pony rides, face painting. Come visit, see Pumpkin Land. And we're going to be tearing it down to get ready for Christmas. Awesome. All right. And down here, I'm, I'm actually going to be taking these home. So these are the edible pumpkins, right? Yeah. This is a, an old French heirloom that's got a new name called Peanut Pumpkin since everything's about decoration today. Yeah. But it's very sweet, great pumpkin, and it's still available. So that's here. why I said never judge a book by its cover, guys. I mean, you can look at this and how ugly, should I say, it looks, <laughs> but how fantastic, I guess, it tastes. And guys, look at this down here. This is my son Jacob uh, kind of roaming yeah. around. What do you think of the pumpkins? Or can you say apples? Where's the apple? <laughs> oh, he says apple, I swear. <laughs> Whenever I ask, but not now. No, yeah. oh, what do you think of this pumpkin? Or can you say apple? There's Our a daddy. smile. No. Yeah. <laughs> I tried, guys. Hi, I Jacob. He talks. Hi. <laughs> Love that so little adorable. Guy. Oh my goodness. Great day with Daddy there. Yeah, there you thanks go. for putting him on TV. You just made uh, our yeah, day. It's fun Adam. to have your kids here. Tell them we thanks said hi, you. okay? Apple. Hi, Jacob. <laughs> I will, Brian. Yeah. All right. Apple. Thanks, bud. That is something. It's cute enough. Doesn't matter no if it says question. a word or not. Yeah. But you know what I think we need here at Action News? We need some treats, and Adam Joseph is at Linvilla Orchards figuring out what to bring back to the station. I want one of those cookies, Adam. Oh, I'm supposed to bring some back to the station? Oops. Now, there's plenty here, as you can see, but I think the worker went on a coffee break, and I saw that this was left open, so why not test, try, taste some of these cookies, which they make every single morning here at Lynn Villa? And, of course, the one thing you cannot forget during the fall season at the farm, apple cider donuts. They are a staple this time of year, and uh, we're going to have... My son is screaming in the halls here. Uh, we're going to have that AccuWeather seven-day forecast, and they've got a lot going on this weekend here that you're not going <laughs> to want to miss. But uh, Rick, Monica, I'm taking orders. What would you like? I'm going to work really hard at baking for you. Oh. Let me know what you want. Pecan and pie. I'll see if I can bring him back to the stage. <laughs> Something already prepared, please. But we want to see your son too, so pick him up <laughs> <laughs> later. All right. The kid was screaming. Oh, I'd he's... scream too if I was watching that. It certainly may not feel like fall on the calendar, but this weekend is going to, so it's a good time to get out and enjoy the changing seasons. That's right. Meteorologist Adam Joseph is standing by Lynn Villa Orchards tonight in Middletown Township with more on this week's outdoor adventure. Hey, Adam. Yeah, Rick, and you know what? This is perfect for you, Rick. You can order your holiday turkeys and those pies since you can't bake at all or cook at all. So this sign is just for you. And actually, the orders began just a couple of days ago, and they're perfect pies here at Limbilla Orchard. And not only you got to get those orders in for the holiday, you can still come here this coming weekend. You can still hit the hayride, a corn maze, and the apples that actually fall off of the tree, they reuse for apple slingshots that you try to hit targets. Did it earlier was a ton of fun, so still bring the kids out this weekend for that. And if you look back behind me here, that is the particular bakery, and they've got so much here that you can kind of taste test through if you want. And also, something else we got to talk about here, which is kind of scary in a way. Uh, two weeks from now, they open up their Cut Your Own Tree. Two weeks from now, we start thinking about the Christmas holiday as they switch from their fall festivities here to the winter holidays. So there's still, Rick, plenty to do and Monica here at Lynn Villa Orchard. Coming up, we'll give you that seven-day forecast. But Rick, make sure you get that pie order in, all right? I, I like mm. the, the turkey, too. Wow. Who you calling turkey? Uh, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Adam. All right, let's head back to meteorologist Adam Joseph at Lynn Villa Orchards in Middle Township, Bucks County, a popular place this time of year, Adam. Oh, and worth it. It's so much fun. Mm -hmm. It's so much fun to bring the family, and of course, I had to bring my son, Jacob. Do you like the microphone? Do you like the microphone? And what else do you like? One thing they have going on right now is a huge apple sale. No matter what type of apple you have, 99 cents a pound. Even the Honeycrisp, which if you know apples, the Honeycrisp is extremely expensive, but you take your pick, and that's for the next couple of weeks. And Jacob, what's this? Apple. There you go. Do you want an apple for saying apple? There you go. It's going to go right in your mouth, I bet. You ready? Eat your apple. You want to eat it? No? I tell you, I worked really hard on this display in between weather hits. Again, you can see those famous Linvilla pies, and you also have the caramel apples, the candy apples, 
which are great this time of year, apple cider. And again, get those apples. They're extremely cheap. And I just found a great looking group of young ladies here. Hi. Did you guys go on to the uh, hayride? Yeah. Yes. How was it? Good. Yeah. All right. Who likes apples? Who likes pumpkin pie? Oh, you actually like some pumpkin pie, huh? And who likes uh, scarecrows and all that fun stuff? They've got still a great display. You got to come here this weekend, Rick and Monica, because you can still go on the hay rides. How about throwing apples in a slingshot? Would that be fun? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you can still do that this weekend as well. And I don't know where my son went. Hey, Jacob, come here, buddy. You still eating the Aww. apple? He come dropped here. it. I heard him say, "Uh oh, we got a new one." Good. Yeah, he said, "Uh oh, he dropped it." Can you wave hi, Jacob? Say bye bye. Say bye to bye to Rick. And turn around. <laughs> oh, you want to play with the kids? Bye, Dora. Yeah. <laughs> Cute. Mm. All right, guys. Enjoy your weekend. Come on. Right. Like yeah, yeah, we like, like we like it? pumpkin pie too. By the way, Adam, just we like all those children. So cute. All right. That. More action news when we come right back. Okay. There. So. Cute.